Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody, man? I want to encourage you guys for this week coming up to just make sure that you are progressing in whatever you're doing. Take the time to actually implement everything that you're trying to do in your life and be able to be the best. I'm telling you guys from my own personal experiences that you have to be able to have things in your life and people in your life that can help you on your journey. So I invested into a personal trainer and a nutritionist to get my body really locked in to start eating more healthy and hold myself accountable. If you don't have some type of barometer, some type of measuring tool to figure out what you're doing, there's no way for you to understand your progression because you don't have anything to measure it measure it against. So for me, I'm going to show y'all real quick uh, the food that I had to purchase and buy. And on my list, it has whatever I'm eating. If it's three ounces of chicken, it has this is going to be 120 calories, you know, 48 carbs and 36 uh grams of protein so i can understand how many calories i'm putting into my body every week how many carbs how many pro how much protein so i can be more efficient in my success and in my growth i have a lot of different uh meetings that i had uh this weekend going into next week on trying to invest into my overall image when it comes to branding when it comes to marketing strategies when it comes to the visuals of what i'm trying to do with the talk show and so forth i got to a certain level that i understand that i have to invest outside of myself to help whatever I'm trying to do come all together. So anyway, I don't want to make this video too long, but I want to just let you guys know how important it is for you to really track your progress and understand what you're doing and why. I have this salmon right here, two different types of salmon. I have some uh, cod fish, fresh. I have some, I don't know what type of fish this was. It's supposed to be um, halibut, but they was out of it. Then I have some uh, some lamb chops here. I have some ground turkey. I had some chicken. I bought me a little griddle to cook everything on. My cousin gave me this tea thing. I just drank some tea earlier. I love that thing. Um, got some fresh green beans. As y'all can see, uh, I have, that's the tea I drank earlier. I put some olive oil and stuff inside of here for my cooking. No salt inside of anything I'm going to be eating. Got some, some other sea moss that came in. Uh, I try to make that anyway. I got a scale, y'all, and it goes ounces, uh, grams, uh, kilograms, pounds, and everything like that. So I can measure everything that I'm putting into my body some asparagus, some uh, some jasmine rice, some spinach, and some cabbage. So I'm going to be meal prepping and putting everything together so I can just monitor what I'm trying to uh, eat and so I can know what I need to add to my diet and take away. So I want you guys to understand the importance of being efficient and, again, having a measuring tool. If you don't have anything in your life that's going to help you to understand what you're doing and why and to show your progress, you might be working against yourself. So anyway, y'all, uh, Monday is coming up tomorrow. And what is tomorrow going to be? Uh, the 19th. So I want you guys to encourage you guys for next week. Whatever you're trying to do, y'all try your best to invest whatever you can into yourself and to your growth to be the better version of yourself. So this is my motivation coming up for the week. Y'all, I hope you had a great weekend. Continue to be great. Be very mindful of where you are in your life and be very grateful for you being able to be healthy and be amongst the living. Anyway, y'all, that's my word. One love from me to you. Remember that it's progress, not perfection. You rest in the end, not the middle. Let's go. Let's grow. Let's build.